Hello everyone, this is attorney Ayhan Agmin and today I'm here to give you some information and latest uh, updates uh, for the DV lottery applications uh, which started since yesterday, October 2nd. Now officially the applicants can be able to apply for the DV lottery green card until November 5th and we would like to actually, we received some questions from our followers and we would like to share with you those questions and our answers and some of the good points that we thought that it could help you uh, during your application process this month. Very first question Question that we have been receiving from our followers is about you know they're trying to access to the state.gov and the website is not responding and they think that is the DV lottery cancelled or not but the answer no is not cancelled it's it's on and it started yesterday it's going to be on for a month uh, but the reason which you might be facing right now with the issue technical issues signing into or filing the applications it could be due to so many applicants trying to apply since it started yesterday so our recommendation will be wait a couple more days and then try again which you you should not have any problem uh, actually doing it and one of the you know advice that we would like to give you make sure that you actually insert the correct information and so that way your application doesn't get actually rejected later on another thing that uh, we would like our followers to pay attention if you do have children under 21 years old make sure that you have to add their information correctly and you have to add their photographs too into the system and make sure that you have the correct photograph requirements which is the passport style you know uh, photograph requirements to make sure that your photograph eligible uh, for DV actual lottery applications another thing that I would like to bring you to attention and actually which is the new thing comparing the next year's this year's there's a uh, actually new um, change which is uh, you have to have a valid passport in order to actually uh, be able to file your DV application so you want to make sure that you have a valid actually passport if you don't get it right away uh, and then when you actually fill up your application there is a, a section uh, which is a uh, section number seven just you want to make sure that you add your correct name and last name and your passport number and your expression date of your passport correctly into the system and we do receive other questions from our followers they're saying oh there's a section on the you know number seven says uh, section B says that uh, you have to you know, people without, without a passport so they don't know what to do with that section so if you do have a valid passport you do not need to worry about that section B just you know avoid that section that's usually applies to uh, people that who don't have a passport or you cannot get a passport so it will not apply to you since you will have actually valid passport and I would like to give one last advice to our followers make sure you're filling up the application correctly without any missing information and make sure that once you file you will receive a confirmation number keep that number in a safe place do not lose it because by next year May you're gonna need it to find out whether you're being selected or not and if you do lose that number you're not gonna get to find out actually uh, and that's not gonna be possible to find what the number was and find out if you were selected or not just so make sure once you file that you actually keep your confirmation number in a safe place and I hope that everyone has the best luck with their application and if there's any news we will be glad to share with you again thank you so much and have a great day